Hi guys, it's Molly from Turtle and today I'm going to teach you how to do three very important things when it comes to your foaming pump. One, how to maintain your pump so that it lasts the longest time possible. Two, how to fix your pump if it ever stops working. And three, where to order replacement pumps or replacement filters if necessary. Please note that filters will only be available as of late April 2023, so you can check the status of this in the comments below. All right, come over to the sink with me and we'll get stuck in. Maintaining your foaming pump. To maintain the pump, please follow five important instructions. One, every time you refill, give the dispenser and pump a rinse. This helps to wash away the buildup of any sediments which may cause your pump to clog. Two, every time you refill, flush the pump with warm water. This also prevents sediment and residue buildup inside the pump. Three, every time you refill, keep the pump off while the tablet is dissolving. This is because pressure can build inside the bottle if the pump is on, and this can cause problems. Four, every time you refill, please fill your water to the line carefully and avoid excess. And for the body wash, this is just above where the bottle starts to curve. This is because excess water can cause water to enter the foaming pump air chamber, which can impact performance. Five, as you use the soap, periodically check your foaming pump air chamber for a buildup of fluid. If there is fluid building up, simply take the pump off and squirt upside down to drain the pump. Following these tips will help you increase the lifespan of your foaming pump. How to repair a broken pump. Unfortunately, many people have run into issues with their foaming pumps after repeated use. This isn't just turtle pumps either, this is an industry-wide problem. We've gone through three iterations of pumps in the last two years, and this is an issue that we're striving to solve, not just for us, but for the circular economy more broadly. Solving this will mark a significant milestone in the global transition from single use to forever use. Here are three most common reasons why pumps stop working and what you can do to fix the problem. One, the pump isn't returning fully after being pressed down. Two, you find the pump is all of a sudden harder to press down and feels clogged. Three, the pump isn't foaming anymore and the soap seems quite watery. In many of these instances, the problem is due to the pump filter being dirty and requiring a quick clean. To clean the filter, one, remove the pump from the bottle, then grip the shoulders and pull the pump head off. It may feel unnatural, but just pull hard and it'll come off. This will expose a removable tube, which is the pump filter. Take this out and give it a rinse to remove any buildup of residue on either side. You can wipe both ends of the filter if necessary. This filter is what helps produce the foam, and when it builds residue, it restricts the flow of the soap causing issues. If the filter is badly damaged or has a buildup of residue on the inside, it may require replacing. We'll discuss that in the next section. Give the rest of the filter components a rinse before piecing it back together. Remember to push down on the foaming head until you hear a click to ensure it's secured correctly. In many cases, this should resolve the issue, but if not, you'll need to replace the filter or the pump. So let's move on to step three. If your filter is badly damaged and needs replacing, we will be including free spare filter replacements in our body wash and hand wash tins from late April 2023. Again, keep an eye on the description and the comments of this video for status updates. Otherwise, if you need to order replacement parts, whether it's a filter or an entire pump, you can head to the accessories section of our website for this. If you're unsure whether you need a replacement filter or an entire pump, you can grab both to be safe and keep spares handy to avoid reordering next time. We don't charge for the replacement pumps or filters, we offer them free with free shipping with any refills only order. What does this mean? Essentially, we're happy to give you pumps as and when needed, but we want to encourage you to try and repair your pump and follow our maintenance guidelines so that you can avoid having to order replacement pumps in the first place. We hope you found this video insightful and if you have been impacted with a pump that isn't foaming, we apologize. We appreciate your understanding as we continue to improve the foaming pump experience, not just for you and I, but for the circular economy.